The major goal of most broiler farmers is to produce quality chickens of 2 kg and 3 kg at period of 6 weeks and 8 weeks respectively. Achieving this goal is important because this will determine the profitability and the growth of the poultry business. In the field, this goal is mostly not achieved mainly due to a number of factors which decrease the growth rate of broiler chickens. Welcome to fellow Agro News YouTube channel. If you have not yet subscribed, please subscribe, like, and share with others. The following are main reasons for slow growth of broilers in broiler chicken farming business. 1. Lack of poultry management knowledge. Poultry management is purely a science, and to get the best in this sector, it must be practiced daily in farm operations. In the broiler production business, to attain the desired and recommended body weight goes beyond buying chicks and feeding them on a daily basis. Most people jump into broiler production without undergoing any form of trainings, and those who have attended any form of training got trained by fellow farmers who learned by trial and error over the years. Any serious farmer should not rely mainly on this form of training to start their own project, as the majority of these people lack the basic understanding behind whatever they are doing. It is advised to find best knowledge from experienced and successful farmers, animal scientists, veterinarians, and poultry management books. Professionalism plays a major role in raising birds of expected size and weight. A little deviation in expected size and weight after 35 days of age can seriously eat into the profit of the project. The most painful thing is most farmers lost their profit without realizing it, because most of them are not keeping an up-to-date financial record of their poultry projects, while they believe they are making profit but actually, they are making huge losses and their capital get lost with each production cycle. 2. The Source of Chicks In most areas, the poultry sector is not well regulated and a lot of adulteration goes on in the industry and this is why a farmer must be mindful of the source the chicks. Good feeding and management can only bring to bear the inherent genetic potential of the chicks and if the chicks are produced from crosses of two different breeds, the chicks will never manifest their full potential because they are mongrels and not full breed. Diseased parent stock and poor hatchery conditions leading to excessive dehydration of chicks and poorly healed navel can contribute greatly to poor growth performance of chicks as this will prevent the chicks from having a smooth start. Also excessive stress, especially during hot season of the years, is another major factor. 3. The quality of drinking water supplied to chickens. Water is the highest nutritional component that a bird will consume throughout its life cycle. Actually, Water is the number one carrier of infectious agents to birds as more than 50% of poultry diseases are waterborne diseases. During the early stage of life, chicks are very fragile due to their poorly developed immune system. At this stage, their exposure to pathogens should be minimal as they cannot fight these pathogens. When exposed to a huge amount of disease-causing agents at this stage, their health become compromised leading to poor appetite, poor growth and huge mortalities if not timely attended. A supply of clean and cool water is very important for the smooth takeoff of chicks. It must be clearly stated that the fact that the water is clear does not imply that such water is free from pathogen. In actual sense, most of clear water supplied to birds on farm is laden with serious level of pathogens, and to achieve good water sanitation on the farm, water treatment with chlorine or iodine-based sanitizer becomes necessary. Other method of water treatment are water acidification, treatment with UV light. 4. Nutritional content of chicken feed. The first few weeks of the chicken life are very important to chicken. Actually, the first few hours 24 to 48 hours play an important role in the life of chicks generally. Accessibility to highly quality feed at this stage of life helps in putting a solid foundation for outstanding future performance. This enhances not just proper growth and development of chicks, but also, yolk utilization, gastrointestinal development and immune system stimulation. Though it might not be practicable to expose chicks to feed few hours after hatch due to factors such as sorting, boxing and transportation, but to ensure that chicks are on a good start, farmers must ensure that they expose their birds to feed as fast as possible, possibly immediately the chicks gets to the farm or few hours after stabilization. This means that the brooder unit must be prepared ready and warmth to the right brooding temperature prior to chicks' arrival with all necessary equipment like chicks' feeders, chicks' drinkers, 
thermometer, and light bulbs in the right quantity, and evenly distributed to give each chick easy and equal access to feed and water. 5. Poultry Diseases It is a well-known that a diseased bird can never perform optimally. This is because most diseases cause depression of appetite and even the little feed that is consumed is major utilized for maintenance and fighting disease, while little or nothing is spared for growth and development. Some poultry diseases like coccidiosis and worm infestation causes serious injury to intestinal linings, reducing the rate of nutrient absorption along the intestine. Majority of the end product of digestion are lost in feces. 6. Overcrowding and High Stocking Density Overcrowding is simply stocking a chicken house beyond its actual capacity. Some of the effects of overcrowding are poor growth performance, poor litter quality, disease outbreak, stress leading to events such as pecking, plucking and fighting, decreased feed conversion ratio, and increased mortality. I hope you have learned something from this video. To enjoy more training videos like this in the future, please subscribe by hitting the subscribe button below this video, like and share with others. Thanks for choosing fellow agro news.